A lawsuit over a Mount Pleasant development could come to a head next week. The town accused of violating one of its own rules. Calma 2 consumer investigator Libba Holland has been digging into the case. This case is about the Park West community. After years of building homes, retail and office space, the developer says he hit a snag. We acquired the property that is now Park West in 1996. For 18 years, Kevin Steelman says his company Park West Development was able to build in the area with flexibility under a 1990 Mount Pleasant ordinance called the Plan Development District, or PDD. According to the lawsuit against Mount Pleasant, PDD allowed the developer to build commercial buildings along with single and multifamily homes in the designated space, as long as they were within density guidelines. We had the discretion to move those in response to market conditions, and so we did that. Steelman's company developed about 3,000 units under the ordinance until 2014. We had a proposed townhome project adjacent to the airport and then an apartment project here at Cambridge Square that were proposed that the town decided that they would no longer allow us to utilize the floating uh, zoning and use the approved density that we had to move forward with those two projects. The lawsuit claims the town denied the proposals, essentially violating its own ordinance. In response to some public pressure, uh, they decided they no longer wanted to follow the ordinance and chose to basically disregard their ordinance and block the project. We didn't want to be in a lawsuit, but that's where we've ended up. I reached out for comment from the town of Mount Pleasant, but have not heard back. The case heads to trial next week. I'll continue to follow the story and bring you updates. In the studio, Libba Holling, Count on Two.